Whether you plan to go wheels up on the tarmac or you'll be hitting the highway, holiday travel can be exhausting and expensive. That's why we're looking at the best ways to make heading home for the holidays as easy as possible this year. Flying over the holiday weeks is something few people look forward to. Probably this year it'll be a little bit more hectic because everybody is at back out and about. If it's not the crowds, it's... Delays, getting stuck, cold, all the things. Jen Bullum has had several bad experiences. Well, you have to assume the flights are going to take off and maybe not have mechanical issues, or maybe not be delayed. After last year's travel meltdowns from various airlines, travels are justifiably nervous. Eric Rosen is the director of travel content at The Point Sky. He says airlines have been working hard to avoid a repeat of last year. But if you're waiting until the last minute to book, don't. Prices are not going to go down. You will not find any magical sales happening. If you want to monitor deals, Eric suggests services like Google Flights or Hopper and picking days to fly that are less popular. Flexibility is always the key to finding the best deals. If you're hitting the road instead, you aren't alone. A good chunk of people are intending to drive this year. Sally French is a travel expert at NerdWallet. She says there are a lot of ways to save money filling up your gas tank. One of the best ways that you can really save gas is simply by avoiding traveling during those high traffic times. Next, avoid pulling into the easiest option and use a savings app like Gas Buddy. You can then go to your map and find the nearest, cheapest gas price for you. Beyond that, you can see if paying cash for your gas will earn you a discount. All ways to make your holiday travel pain-free, unless, like Janina Nixon, you decide to just stay home. I make a point not to do so. That way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteris.